All right, everybody. Well, hey, thank you so much for joining us here on this webinar. I think you guys are going to get a ton of great stuff out of this. We are honored to have the man, the myth, the amazing Aaron Young joining us from uh, Lawfulness. He's joining us up from, uh, you're at home today? Is that where you're at? I'm in, well, I'm in, I'm in Battleground, Washington. Battleground, Washington there. So yes. almost home, 15 minutes from the farm. Very nice, very nice here. But for those that uh, may not know who Aaron is, he is the CEO over at Magna, uh, not Magnify Your Wealth, but at Lawfulness Associates, which is over four, what, 49 plus years of working with entrepreneurs, business owners, uh, in a variety of ways. Not only helping them put their books together, help them with the, uh, the accounting and the, the, the documents required to stay compliant, to make sure you avoid piercing that corporate veil of protection so you can keep your businesses safe, keep your assets safe is a better way to say it, I would, I would talk about there. And uh, we are honored to have you. Many of you guys may know that we've uh, had him on before talking about the different corporate veil protection, asset protection, but we want to do a little something different this Monday night on uh, Note Night America. We wanted to talk a little bit about an upcoming event he has coming up here um, before too long, but I we did a little different thing, spin on it. We want to go through the 10, the top 10 reasons to attend Magnify Your Wealth. Because you don't really don't we, we don't really bring up with this a lot of the time. We talk about, hey, it's a great event, and it's one of the, I believe, the one of the top two events that you need to attend if you're an entrepreneur business owner. I think it's the number one that you need to attend. Wow. Um, I, I, I totally believe this with all heart and soul based on not only everybody that's been through the event there, I think those that have attended will agree with me, but also what we go through as entrepreneurs, right, Aaron? Well, the whole goal of Magnify Your Wealth is to, it's not a big, um, it's not a big expo, right? There's nope. not a ton of sponsors. There's not a lot of people that we have to appease. Our goal is to help the attendees and you know, a lot of them are people that are already our clients that show up. We've got a lot of clients. So the goal is to give them the best, most current information I possibly can. Um, uh, that was weird. <laughs> Sorry, my, my email just popped up in front of my face and oh. <laughs> I don't know, and I can't figure out why. But anyway, it, the goal is to give people the most pertinent uh, information that's going to help them in their business right now in a way that um, that they can go home and they can do something with it. And I know we'll go through the top 10, but uh, the the fact is, is that it's, it's designed, it's designed for business owners to be more successful because at the end of the day, our goal is to have clients that stay with us for a long, long, long time. So yeah. that's what we designed it to do. And you guys have done a tremendous job with that. I mean, anybody that's been through it walks away with so much valuable, a variety of things which we won't give the cat, let the cat out of the bag yet. So what do you say we dive into? I think yeah, we can dive in. We'll dive All right. in. All right. So drum roll. The number 10 reason to 10 magnify your wealth. San Diego. It's in a beautiful spot. Always gorgeous. You've never been to San Diego. It is a beautiful spot there. We don't want to go through number nine yet. Don't talk about it. But it is just a great spot. You're, I mean, literally, this is a, an image not too far. Actually, it's right, it's right off above the, where the, the hotel is at. But you've got – it's just an energy there. The wind coming off of Mission Bay, yeah. the sun, the palm trees. It's just a beautiful spot. So I love it there. And, um, uh, by the way, just from a technology perspective, Scott – when that thing came up, I lost the, the show. So I can see you and me, but I can't see the slide. So you'll have to feed them to me. But okay. here we go, folks. Year after year, um, uh, people say to me, do you think you'll ever go somewhere else besides San Diego? And I'm like, well, I don't know what the future holds, but I love going to San Diego. Mm -hmm. And we, the place we do the event is right on Mission Bay. Yep. So there are all the boats that are sitting there in the water and there are people out going out fishing and you have all the birds and everything. And it's, it's a very um, relaxing place to, to go and just get focused on 
your business. Yep. Not be downtown where there's a lot of other action going on, but be somewhere that's really a, a lovely, tranquil place, almost, dare I say it, a little bit meditative. When you watch the water, you hear the, the ocean sounds, you hear the, the shore birds, um, you see the boats bobbing in the water. It's very, it's lovely. And there's big lawns and it's just a beautiful, beautiful place. And um, I've purposely kept the event small, partly because I love holding it at this hotel. We used to go to Las Vegas and have it in these huge ballrooms. And it, I feel like it's much more intimate, much more, um, we, we bond more closely with the attendees at this venue. And of course the weather, <laughs> I'll tell you what, the end of April or in uh, November when we do the fall event or October, November, usually the weather in many parts of the country is not so great. San Diego, pretty darn good. Always yes. great. I mean, you're literally just a few minutes away from the beach. Um, it's just a beautiful, beautiful area. San Diego is just something energetic about it. I love, don't get me wrong, I love Austin. San Diego would be the one place I would move to if I didn't love Austin so much for the most part. But that takes us, we've given a little bit of the cat out of the bag. But that takes uh -oh. us to number nine here because you did say something really great about this place. And if people can check this out, the number nine reason you want to take Magnify Your Wealth is really kind of what Aaron just said. I call it number nine. It is the Dana. It is the hotel, as you say. This is an overhead view. So you see the marina. You see the views, this big half moon hotel, waking up in the morning, looking at the ocean. I always try to book the one down here in this bottom heart where I walk out in the patio and I can just breathe in, enjoy it. It's a great hotel yes. if you've got kids too, because there's a pool there. They've got all sorts of water sports for the kids. You could rent a bike. SeaWorld is just a stone's throw away if you want to have the kids come and go there. The, the staff is second to none at the Dana. They always bend over backwards. Amazing food. Let's, you know, the food's awesome there. And, oh. uh, <laughs> you know, it's funny. When, place. when we both wrote our top 10, I had food separate <laughs> from uh, the, des the location because I agree, though. They... The restaurant there, the catering there, um, of course, we provide a ton of food. Yep. Um, we, we have stuff at breakfast time, we provide lunch, and then one evening we provide dinner. And uh, this is only uh, a three-day, two-night event, so that's a lot of food. Yep. But the food is great, and um, we get more compliments on the freaking catering at the Dana than I've ever had at any other event in any other hotel Anywhere we've done it around the world, the Dana does a terrific job on the food. Yeah, I mean, and this is not your, I mean, and, and, and the price point too, you guys have a great room block that's affordable. There's a couple of different upgrades you can do with the hotels. If you wanted to have that half moon or you've got, there's a, another spot there too. It, once you get a, a ride there, there's not really any reason to leave for the most part. Everything is, can be done right there. And it, it, it's very relaxing. They've got fire pits out there at the evenings if you're wanting to sit around and, and a network and we'll get a little bit more of that later on it's just a really great place and the restaurant there is is is, is really one of the top i you know top 10 restaurants i think in, in san diego i love going there dragonfly so, they do a terrific job yeah. yeah exactly that takes us to number eight we get some more of the goodies here number eight is really the content of the discussion now we won't get away with uh it is but the content at this event, I think, is should be required of all entrepreneurs out there, Aaron. I mean, you guys go into so much about estate planning and tax, you know, tax preparedness, um, wealth planning. I mean, it's really, that's why I put that image there. You, people are taking things and growing their wealth, magnifying their wealth out there. And when I came to the first time you, you invited me to the event, I came to literally l learn and I remember sitting there like, oh, my gosh, I did not know this. Oh, my God, this content I had not heard before. Yeah, we've heard a little bit about people pitching asset protection and some different things, but not the in-depth of the content and the deep dive that you guys do at this event. It's second to none. So the thing with the content for me is you go to so many events where they, they, they tease you with content. They give you the result. If if only you had my content, then you could get these magic results. And 
I, I understand why so many events do that because they have to make a buck. But um, we always come into the event, even though our prices are, our ticket prices are low, we always come into the event in the black. So we're not trying to hit a certain revenue uh, result. Our goal is, as I said earlier, is to um, hold on to our clients for many, many, many years. And the best way to do that is to be teaching them what is currently going on, what the new rules are, um, what's going on tax-wise, what's going on uh, uh, legality-wise, courtroom-wise, what's going on financial strategy-wise, what are some other investment um, things that maybe they don't know much about. You know, everybody understands, oh, I'll buy stocks or I'll put money in a 401k or IRA, uh, buy mutual funds, or, or if they say I want real estate, which is great, but you know, I could bring somebody and talk about real estate, but they're not gonna be able to give the tip, of, you know, they talk about fix and flips or whatever, right. but we've had you there talking about notes because most people, don't understand about notes and most people don't understand about oil and gas most people don't understand about family foundations most people don't understand about um, real estate investment trusts they don't know how to use these personally Mm -hmm. and once you learn it no matter where you are in your progress once you at least know these things exist then you can as you hit different milestones in in the growth of your business or your wealth, you go, oh, maybe now is the time to do it. But if we're not teaching it, how will you ever know? How will you ever know? So we make the content king at this event. And that's why none of our presenters, and I don't know if this is one of your slides, Scott, but none of the presenters will make a a sales offer, except for us. It's no pitch. We we make one offer for our mastermind. But the fact is most of the spots that ever get opened by people dying or, you know, whatever, we actually, we don't have very much turnover in our little mastermind group. And mostly those people have already joined it before we talk about it Mm -hmm. because they talk to other people there. So there's not, you're not feeling like you have to steal yourself for that pitch that's now coming the last 10 or 15 minutes of the talk you're getting the entire time period full of content. Yeah, and, and that's a big thing is it, it allows for you to go in and be able to really learn because the speakers, we'll get to that in a second here, really do deliver and it's there to educate, okay? And it's um, legal. So you might have trust law, contract law, intellectual property law, tax planning, tax uh, strategy, which is different financial strategy, investment strategy, um, business entities, board of director compliance, um, high level asset protection strategies. And that's why you came and and fell in love. And I've had people that have come in there that were um, kind of were people that I knew and they they showed up and some of these people are incredibly wealthy. Um, a lot of people throw the billionaire thing around. Remember, there aren't that many billionaires, but we've had people that are way deep into the hundreds of millions of dollars, um, including real estate investors who have huge portfolios of owned outright real estate who come and go, oh my gosh, I never knew this stuff before. And they're sitting down. Well, we'll talk about that in a minute, but the point is, is that, um, this isn't just for startups and it's not, and if you're super successful, you don't go, don't discount yourself. We cover a whole story arc from the beginning to taking your company public or selling it or passing it on to the next generation. Um, you're going to get all of that over the three days. Yeah. That's the, that's the beautiful thing. You never know who you're sitting next to and the experiences that those people have that you, you go through. So if you're starting off, Hey, don't come in overwhelmed. Like, Oh my God, I got to do all these things. There's like peeling back an onion. That's the beautiful thing about this. Aaron and his uh, uh, team doing a great job of like, okay, let's structure it here. You may not get to this point, but there's something you want to keep in mind for later on for you. So that kind of takes us to number seven. Which is? Well, it helps if I hit the right button to move the slides. Is the experts. It's literally the experts. Yeah, like I- Okay, so I just talked about that. But when you've got one of the top- trust lawyers 
in the country who's represented for the California bar, one of the most active legal communities in the country is California, a very litigious state. Um, the guy who ran that department and was the head guy, first teaching asset protection and trust, and then was on the ethics committee for the state. I mean, that's pretty freaking good. Mm-hmm. One of the top intellectual property lawyers, some of the top financial planning uh, people who've been doing this for 30 years, 40 years. I mean, we've had former CEO of Samsung. We've had founder of WebMD. We've had, uh, I mean, it, I don't know, it just goes on and on. This, right. I don't know if, if it's a slide. Do you have a slide for our, our special speaker this no, time? No, because you have different speakers on it all the different times. So Okay, well, let me... Like- I mean, talk about who you've got coming this time around. It'll be somebody different the next time around, but you've got a really great expert coming this time. We both well, know. one of my fa- so I always try to bring somebody in and they're usually one of my friends. All these people that I just mentioned were my friends, uh, people that I know uh, this year or this time uh, on April. He'll actually be either on May 1st or 2nd, but this is April 30th, May 1st, May 2nd is are the dates. And Um, Brian Smith, the founder of Uggs, you know, Uggs boots, the shearling boots, multi-billion dollar brand. Brian Smith is going to be there and talking about how do you start out like he did from the trunk of his car and build this thing up and then find a buyer and sell it and then, then have to go back and buy it back again and then grow it and then, then sell it to a huge company. And then what did he do after that? You're going to hear from a guy who knows how to build enormous brands. And he's got two more awesome projects that he's in the middle of right now that are big. One of which is going to impact many, many, many business owners who have, um, who use online marketing and sales as a big part of their, uh, their sales process. So Brian is going to be our very special guest. Everybody's awesome. There's not, a clunker in the group. There's not. Everybody's top of the top of their field. But this time our special guest is Brian Smith, founder of UGG. And um, but you never know who's gonna walk in. Uh, I'm I've had multiple what you'd call big names walk in during the event and uh, just say, Oh, Aaron, I know you're busy, I know you've got this, but I just wanted to come in and say hi. I just wanted to come see your group. Hey, do you have time to go get a cup of coffee or whatever? I mean, this is, this event is I known have, for having I, great experts. It is. And it's the thing is I've actually flown out to the event to go meet with the experts for an hour or two, not to speak before. I literally flew out to California to San Diego because I had something else going on, but I was like, I'm not speaking this time, but I want to get out there. I got to talk to Kevin. I got to talk to Brent and I, I need to get them together in the same room for a little something. And that was a beautiful thing. And like, that's the same thing. You get these experts. They're not charging. Kevin Day charges what three fifty five hundred dollars an hour? No, 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 seven hundred dollars an hour. Sorry, I was shooting him short there. Seven hundred dollars an hour. But He's the, one of the top guys in the country on yes. his topic. And that's the beautiful thing: the, the experts are there to sit with you to go through things, no charge. I know that he sat down um, with somebody previously, one of our students out of the Temple area, and said, "Oh, hey." You've got way too complicated a plan for what you're going. Let's streamline it. You don't need all these things. Or even another thing. Oh, hey, you're in good position. You don't need anything else. Your plan is on the great is on the path to where you need to be. They're there to literally help you, not say, hey, pay my hourly fee. Here to help me give you my Or to sell you more stuff. Exactly. They're not here to sell you. They're here to help you on help you magnify your wealth of what you have or help you get to where you need to be, right, Aaron? Before you move on to the next slide, let me just say, one of the things that we, one of the foundational pieces that our company is built on, and the reason we have 87% renewal amongst our clients year over year, the reason we have clients that have been with us 30, 35 years, the reason we have high, big name clients, another Texas boy, Matthew McConaughey, you know, I met him a couple of years ago at a fundraiser and he said, what do you do? And I said, I own a company called Laughlin Associates. He goes, oh, I'm your customer. I said, yeah, I I know. I just don't want to bring it up. You know, but there's a reason why people from the entry level to wildly successful stay with us for years. And it's because we believe 
found, fundamentally believe you, we don't want to sell our clients too little or too much. We want you to have only what you need, not less than you need. Cause a lot of people will cheese out on you and, and to get a sale, we'll sell you something less than complete, but that less than complete thing won't serve you if you get into any number of situations, lawsuit, audit, government contract, um, raising money, bankruptcy. I mean, any, any of the positive or negative things that can happen if you're not organized just properly, the, the entity or entities cannot serve you. What we don't want to do is burden people with a whole bunch of stuff they don't need. And they're like, why did they sell me all this junk? And so part of, one of the things we do is a blueprint strategy. And if you attend the event, we do it for you for free. And it's basically looking at your world and coming back with ideas of how to streamline and say, as you hit different mile markers in your path, then maybe now it's time to talk about something new, but you don't, you don't need it all now. You just need to be aware as you get to different places in growth or it, as you get smaller, what, actually needs to stay in place and what doesn't. And that's a real benefit is to sit with, as you said, get the lawyer, get the accountant, get the financial person all together in one, at one table and have a meeting for an hour instead of trying to go home and remember what you learned and tell your lawyer and they, they give you something. Then you go talk to your CPA and they tell you something different and there's no meeting of the minds. This gives you a chance to sit with people and get a holistic idea of precisely what will be right for you as you go forward for the next 6, 12, 24, or you know, who knows, indefinitely. Um, but you really want to, you want to be in the know. And the best way to do that is to sit down with people that are experts in the field and get clarity on next steps. And that's what we provide. As a matter of fact, at the last, no, two events ago, because I don't, I actually just don't know the number from the last time. But two events ago, we did over 400 private appointments between the attendees. And remember, we only take up to 100 people. Mm -hmm. So on average, every attendee was having at least was having four meetings. Um, some of them had less, some of them had more. There's, you're not restricted, but we try to get you with the right people. So you actually are solving problems and not just you know, kind of wasting your time, but we do want to get you with the right people. Over 400 private appointments over three days. That's pretty impressive. Very impressive. If you think about how, how, much, how much was accomplished and how much education specific to the customer was provided in those appointments. Pretty dang cool. And these guys and gals show up early and they stay late. It's Isn't not that the truth. They definitely go above and beyond. And if they can't find out the answer for you while you're there, they definitely work afterwards to help you out with it quite a bit. And they'll introduce you to somebody if they're not the solution. Exactly. That is true. If they're not the solution, they're right to do that. The next one, number six. And this is one that we all love, and it's why we like to attend events, is the networking. I mean, you never know who you're sitting next to. You never know what kind of a business they're running or how successful they are or what they have. I, I, I love your event. I think it's one of the best networking events I go to every year because there's people looking to do some things. Plus, you do a very interesting take the first night of the event that is just really helps put people at ease and really builds relationships throughout the three days. Why don't you talk about that a little bit, Aaron? Yeah. Oh, the first night? First night, yeah. Well, we, we rent this great big uh cruise boat um and we you know 100 and 100 of us all climb on the boat and we go out and we do a cruise a, a sunset cruise all around mission bay uh if the weather's quiet we'll cross over the bar and go out into the pacific sometimes they'll know that there's um a pod of whales or a pod of dolphins and we'll go out and um try to catch the whales or, or you know see the whales or see the dolphins watch the sunset. We, we have the full catering. We have the bar. Everything's there. So people can come out there, sit indoors or outdoors on the boat. On the I guess it's a ship. Um, it's just us on the, on the ship. And uh, the staff knows us real well. 
that we do this twice a year with them. We have a great time. There's plenty of food, plenty of drink, uh, nice, quiet, gorgeous sunset cruise. And people just relax and they're surprised that this is just included with the trip or with the ticket. And they get to go out there and not only do they enjoy the beauty of Mission Bay and the Pacific Ocean and the sunset, but they're having a great time just walking around, sitting on chairs, standing by the deck and talking to the other people that are there. It is a tremendous way to do two things. One is it creates a shared experience. Every, virtually everyone, I mean, you're not required to go on the ship, but virtually everybody goes. Um, so everybody has that experience together. So that it's kind of fun and people look forward to it if they've attended before. And it, it puts everybody in kind of a different setting. There's not, I don't know, when you're bouncing, well, not bouncing, but when you're bobbing around on the ship and you're grabbing your, you know, charcuterie or your, your, uh, your beer or your chips and dip, you're, it kind of levels everybody out. Yeah. Nobody's trying to posture for who's coolest at the event or at the table. And it really is a, a way for everybody to relax and chat and share ideas. And you're right. I'll tell you what, um, what's well, only been a year ago. I, uh, it'll be a year this April. Um, I'm staying up front. I'm doing the, the opening talk of the event. And uh, there's this man sitting in the front row and he's just got his arms crossed and he's leaning back and his legs are way out in front of him. He's kind of half laying backwards and laying back, lounging in his chair, straight faced, couldn't get a reaction out of this guy at all. Serious. And I'm trying to get him to, he became the only guy I was playing to in the room. I was trying to get him to smile at something I said or to nod his head or to raise his hand, nothing. And I, I, I got to admit, Scott, and you know, as a speaker, that, those guys kind of freak you out a little bit when yeah. you can't get any re reaction. Like, what are they judging? How are they judging me? Well, he came up to me on the break and he said, you know, I've been a client of this company for 32 years. Uh, this is the first time I've been to an event in the last 20 years. So this is the first time I've ever seen Aaron Young. Because remember, we bought the company in 2001. And he said, I'm now the third largest minority owned company in the United States. Everybody on this thing, the fact that we're on this call like this, he gets paid a licensing fee for this audio video that we use in all these different technologies. Check this out. He said, now I would have never known that we had this level of success sitting in the front row, staring me down, right? Mm -hmm. um, but once we had talked, he loosened up, smiled, got friendly. He said, Aaron, I've built my entire empire worth well over, well, it's in the billions of dollars on the strategies I learned from Laughlin. Mm. And you don't know who you're sitting, who's sitting in front of you, who you're sitting next to, who you're standing by in the boat. You don't have any idea. They are just regular folks. But then you start talking to them, you go, oh my gosh, you've got a, a, a chain of 100 restaurants? Oh, you've flipped 63 houses this year? Oh, you've got how many rental properties? You've got, you do, you build, you have the, how many shipping containers on cargo ships? I mean, you do what? You just don't know. You just don't know. Exactly. And it's amazing, amazing networking. It is amazing networking, definitely. Definitely, definitely good. That takes us to number five. And the ability, once you've gone to this event, you've sat down with the experts, you've loosened up, you've identified and really gotten the content. And number five is, is kind of may not seem much, but it is. And it's literally the knowledge that you take away from this place. And it's, it's not just content, because we all can learn. But I'm a big believer that knowledge is actually something that you actually do and implement and re have the knowledge that, hey, oh, I can accomplish this or I can get this done. There's a lot of, as I say, lights that go off during the event. That's why we use the light bulb and we're using the 
thing here, but the knowledge here of that you take away, that you've got a plan of action, you understand that you've been protected, that's a really big thing in today's world of uncertainty. If the content isn't actionable, if you can't do something, if you can't sit and have a conversation with somebody, whether it's one of the experts or one of the attendees and sit and go, oh, now I see how to take this one thing yes. and, and do it. That if you can't leave and you're gonna be better off for having attended, then we've really failed. Um, I, I saw earlier, I saw, maybe it was on Facebook. Were you doing something with Juliet Clark earlier? I did do, yeah, I had a, right before her, I was doing with Juliet, yeah. So Juliet Clark, I met her somewhere and she came to Magnify Your Wealth. And I got, and Juliet, um, <clears throat> maybe she's watching right now, but Juliet is kind of like, she doesn't suffer fools, right? <laughs> she's kind of no nonsense and she'll tell you and when I, when I heard that she was coming to the event, I was actually a little bit nervous because I thought, oh, she's not, um, she's not a built-in sort of fan. She's, she could come in and really you know, give me this, the, 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 a negative review. And I got a text message back from her um, after the event was over. And she said, you know how skeptical I am. Maybe it was this or maybe it was inner circle. But it was a thing where she, inner circle is the one thing that we do promote um, there. But whatever it was, she came back and she was like, you know how skeptical I am. This really delivered. Mm -hmm. This event actually did what it promised it would do. And, I'm, and I've got stuff now I can actually do to help my business. And I can't blame her for being dubious about going to another event mm -hmm. because so many of them are just one giant sales pitch to get, you know, come and all we're doing is building up to our $50,000 product or $100,000, you know, that's all it is. And that in my mind is a way to make quick money, but it's not, it's You're not, not the way business. to build a long-term real company. Yeah, exactly. And you don't stay in business for 40, almost, we're coming right up on 49 years. We're in our 49th year. Um, you can't build a company that retains clients the way we do, retains employees the way we do, um, by tricking people. You can't do it. So the content, the knowledge that you'll walk away with is something that you'll be able to use right away. You won't have to buy some program, get some gimmick. If only you can move to our next level. There is no next level of the Magnify Your Wealth Summit. There's actionable content and there's the Inner Circle Mastermind Group if you want that. And even there, there's no hard sales pitch. No. There's no hard sales pitch at all. And by the way, there's hardly any way to get into it because most people don't drop out and we limit the number because that's how we believe in doing it. We have to be able to give you real ongoing value. And that comes by giving you stuff you can use and letting you walk away with the knowledge of not just how to ride a bike, but actually starting to ride the bike. Yeah, exactly. That's the difference between learning and gaining wisdom. Well, Knowledge is learning. And then wisdom is what did I learn from now doing it? I want people to get both at Magnify Your Wealth Summit. And that's the great thing too. It's not just, you've got, you don't know who you're sitting next to and the knowledge that they have that they will, you know, pass on to you because they've been through your shoes. They've been where you're at, where, you know, they've got other things that may overcome and help you with something you have going on in your business or your life and stuff like that. So that's the thing I've always taken away. I've gotten so much from the other attendees and knowledge besides delivering content and providing stuff for everybody. I've also taken knowledge away from the things that I didn't know about. I was like, Oh, that's interesting. I'd like that. Or I could figure that out and help it. And it made me a much smarter person for attending. So, you know, and not to belabor this, Scott, thank you for saying that. But again, people are on this call tonight or on this zoom conference because they follow Scott Carson. Well, 
Scott Carson was just sitting there as an attendee. Scott and Steph were sitting there at a table like everybody else. Nobody around you necessarily knew that you were a leader in actually now several industries. Nobody knew that, right? You were there to learn. But if somebody sat and talked to you and they were involved in real estate or they're looking a place to put some money, they could have thought they could have met you and got, oh, and Jeff Flam, who is a billionaire, um, has come and sat in the audience, yep. you know, and not, he's not a speaker. He was attending and I shouldn't maybe have said that, uh, please edit that out. But um, the, uh, the point is I can tell you lots and lots and lots of people who are leaders in their industry who come to this event to sit in the chairs and learn. And it's, it's because of that fundamental actionable up-to-date content. That's what people come for. People, that's why they return. And it's what makes this an unusual event in the sea of uh, business educational events. And it's why I think um, we sell out every time. Yep, exactly. That takes us to number four. Wow, number, number four, four already. Number four already. Because when you can take what you learn and you apply the knowledge, you can walk out of the Dana on your way home on San Diego. And this is a big thing that a lot of people are searching for. You know, there's two biggest things and it's called time and money are two of the biggest fear factors, but also it's peace of mind that you get a lot of times, which I think a lot of people forget about. There are things that keep us all up at night. Like, oh my God, do I have my things? Do I have my entity set up right? Am I doing the right tax strategies for where I'm at? Have I outgrown my previous one? And that's why I put this in as the number four one, because you see that with so many people coming to your event who may be stressed, have some sort of thing going on, but they walk out because they have some solutions and they have a plan. Wow, you said that perfectly, but that is one of the things, I think that's the reason clients stay with us for so yep. long, yep. is because they, as I said, we're not trying to oversell or undersell in the course of doing business throughout the years. What we're trying to do is help people know what is useful, right, and proper by bringing all these experts in so that somebody goes, okay, now I, I know where I stand. Yep. Now I know if there's something out of alignment, I know exactly what to do to fix it. Or now I heard something, I've made the shift, you can't believe how many calls we do during the event well, where one of our experts, whether they're a Laughlin employee or they're one of the people that we've brought in that are, there's kind of a core team and then we always have kind of people that rotate through that do different things. Mm -hmm. It's always um, heartwarming to me to know that these experts and that my team will get on a conference call during the event with that client's CPA or their partner, or their lawyer, or their spouse, and, and get resolution on things during. So they're not having to go home and try to go, oh, I don't, I, I kind of remember, I've got some notes. They know exactly where they, what they need. They're able to make moves. We help them with that. And they do, they leave going, ah, check that one off the list. Now that's fixed. That's fantastic. And it, it's one, of, again, it's the thing we strive for is to take this stuff off of your plate so that you can go out and do what you do best, which is run your business, sell your product, sell your service, fulfill on your promises. And we will help you with all these fundamental foundational things that most people know very little about. We want to give you peace of mind. We want you to sleep better at night. And especially we want you to sleep well knowing that you're protected. At Laughlin, our mission is, when, if you ask our team, what's, our, what's Laughlin's mission statement? It says, we are fortress builders. We build fortresses around our clients' personal and business assets. That is why we exist. It's why we're open for business, is to help you guys be safe. That's our intention, and that's what we strive for. And the event, Magnify Your Wealth Summit, is the most overt 
example of us trying to bring the best stuff we have together to give you that peace of mind that you described, Scott. Yeah, I totally agree. And I'm a big believer in it. And I hear that from over again and again, because there's something about being able to sleep at night and relax a little bit because stress is a killer. And the more you can take off your, your stress, the better off you'll be, the more you'll enjoy life and be able to make big things and exciting things happen and take that next yeah. step. So True story. Uh, you've talked a little bit about number three. Uh, number three is an amazing group. It's a, it's the uh, Laughlin inner circle, the Aaron Young inner circle that you have going on, the mastermind that you do. Oh, that's on your list. It's on my list. It's number three. Yes. <laughs> number, the, do you want me to talk about the inner yes. circle? Talk a little about it. Now, this is an actual picture. And I had to cut off about half the group to get it to fit in here properly for you. There I wish I could see your slides. I don't, I'm afraid to push any buttons in case I lose this. <laughs> but um, I really want to see it. But anyway, okay. The inner circle is something that we started – maybe three years ago now, something like that. And I didn't want to do it, actually. Yeah. I, was, I resisted it quite uh, vehemently. And Megan Cole, our VP of marketing, really talked me into doing it. And basically, here's the deal. She said, I think we need to do um, um, some kind of a special, higher touch, mastermind kind of a group. And I said, boy, there are so many people out there doing masterminds. And, and they're, you know, how to write a book or how to give a speech or how to invest in real estate or how to do whatever. And there are plenty of people already doing this. And that is not the real nature of our business. So I don't want to just be another one of these. And she said, but Aaron, people want more than they can get. They want more, they want more high touch. They want to sit more knee to knee with me and with other people. And I said, okay, let me think what we could do. And the conclusion that I came back to her with was, I'll tell you what, how about if we introduce the people that I personally work with, that are my personal associates, if I can get my team of people to be willing to mentor and to give some time to the participants, I would feel good about that because that's not something you can readily get elsewhere. And it would be, these are all people that are my people, my, the ones that I've vetted, that are, I've chosen to work with. And for those of you that don't know me, that may not mean much, but I've been starting and building companies, both public and private companies for 37 years. And I've built, I don't know, close to two dozen multi, multi, multi-million dollar companies. And I've figured out who I want to work with and who I don't. And, um, so anyway, we pulled that group together. And so it's not like the original idea was this is Aaron's inner circle of service providers that I will introduce to this group. And that was the big draw at first. By the way, I did the worst, most horrible job of introducing this at the event because I was so reticent to be an also ran to be like everybody else. I didn't want to do it. Well, but people joined and, and now, I mean, I think there's something like we, it's the max we've maxed it at 50 participants, which may seem like a lot, but not everybody can come to everything. Right. Um, so you get a really good turnout. Um, some of the results, Scott have been mind boggling. Yeah. Uh, one guy, uh, one, we put him in with our, our financial strategy people. They restated his taxes. They're not tax people. They showed him different things he could, he could do in his industry to reduce his taxes. And they re, uh, working with his CPA, restated his taxes, and he got $230,000 back. Do you think he was delighted about his $5,000 investment? He's totally excited. Um, <laughs> um, I'll use that same guy as an example. Um, his primary goal was his wife was head of HR, VP of HR for a big Silicon Valley company. She was commuting two hours each way to and from work every day. And they're empty nesters, but he 
he missed his, his, uh, you know, his wife, his sweetheart. He didn't want to be without his girlfriend for all these to me. Plus she was very stressed. So he said, my primary goal in joining the inner circle is to grow my real estate business sufficient to replace her very significant salary at this publicly traded Silicon Valley company. She's vice president of HR. I said, what's your timeline? He said, six years. I said, perfect, let's go. Guess how long it took? Well, I won't ask you to guess. I'll tell the audience. It took him 13 months to replace his income. And she now attends the inner circle every time with him because she, did, she was able to leave her job. They were, by the things they learned, the things they restructured based on the people that are there, it magnified their wealth to where she could do that. And, but I can tell you story after story after story after story after story of people who've had these fantastic results. It is and that, so the inner circle is not something we're, I'm not trying to sell it here. And no. I don't even really have to sell it at the event because the members of the inner circle talk to the other members that are other attendees and people are coming up to us going, how do I get into the inner circle? So there's no hardcore pitch on that. It's just like, here's what it is. Here's what we do. If you're interested, you need to talk to us before this. Cause we do have on the last day, we do have a planning lunch where everybody does a little bit of work and sets their intentions for the next six months. And so that's the leverage. If you want to be in the planning meeting, you can, but there's no lower price. There's no, there's no, um, like run to the back room to buy it. It's, if it's right for you, do it. If you don't want to do it now, you can do it later, but you will miss this uh, intention meeting. But beyond that, you could join it next month. Although there's no real good way to join the inner circle. We don't really push it anywhere on the websites or anything because it's usually full and we're, I don't know. I just don't want it to be one of those things. I want people to feel like that's their new community and they're going to stay with it. A lot of those people, well, almost everybody that joined that first time three years ago is still in it today. Yep, they sure are. And so anyway, there you go. Good stuff. Good stuff. Now, number two, number two, everybody. And I'm going to talk about this a little bit. It's Aaron Young and his team. Oh. And his team. All right. Uh, Brent. Megan, everybody that comes out, Lee comes to the event and hangs out. Everybody on your team. I'm not just talking about the experts, but although they feel a lot like family. You're talking about the Laughlin employees. I'm talking about the e e Laughlin team and how they're there to support. I mean, Brett goes above and beyond. Megan goes above and beyond to really get the chance to know the attendees, what they're going through. How can they best refer them to their right spot? That's how I met Juliet. You actually, hey, you need to have, you need to call Scott Carson and talk to Scott, Juliet. And so I get a text message from me. I'm like, okay. And then Juliet calls me. I'm like, yeah, sure. How can I help? Same thing. Like I can get Debbie on the phone and talk over there. That's the thing that's really second to none for the most part is, is just the team. You can feel it from the moment you arrive. The moment, bef well before you get there, you feel it from the inner circle. You feel it from the other attendees that have repeated have gone to the event. That yeah. hey, we're here. Let's get let's get some appointments booked for you. Let's sit down and, and make sure that you're not missing what so and so is talking about. Let's really talk about what you want to do. Let's leave a leg. If you're looking to build a legacy or build more wealth or do other things, let's work to get that done. You also have a uh, uh, you you also bring in. Uh, you're very passionate about a couple of different charities that you work with on a regular basis yeah. too. That most people don't realize. We have we have. Um... So one of our inner circle members is, uh, she is doing, I don't know, miraculous things in Africa right now, helping the most disadvantaged people. The other, the other one that we've done a lot of work with is the Unstoppable Foundation, yeah. which uh, I've been, I'm on their board of, uh, of governors and, you know, we've put almost 40,000 girls through school now in wow. Kenya girls that would have just been carrying water every day from the stream back to the village, four miles. Um, these kids are, we've built schools, we've done all this stuff and we've raised money for that at our events. We're taking a one-time one break from that this time 
because the this charity that we're going to work with on this event coming up, um, I'm so my mind is so blown by what this very sweet, wonderful, humble woman has done to save lives in a significant, broad way. Some of the things she's doing are amazing. And I and the team and I talked to, we said, you know, let's let's feature her this time because she is one of the family and she's just crushing it. I mean, she's doing such terrific work against all odds. And I, I, I don't know. And you know, the other person we haven't mentioned that I'm going to mention now. Hang on. Is, is your lovely oh. wife. Your, your, oh, did, were you going to bring her up? Because <laughs> <laughs> Michelle, she, she plays full out there at the event too, is sitting there taking me. So there's a mental aspect of what we're going through as entrepreneurs. And she does such a great job coaching people and working with people one-on-one -on -one as well there. And, uh, you know, she, I, I, she's part of the team. You know what I mean? So Mich Megan Cole, our VP of marketing came to me a couple of years, several years ago and said, I think your wife, Michelle, who's an executive coach should, uh, present at the event. And I said, what? She's a, she's a, a, like a life coach. And what does that have to do with hardcore business? <laughs> oh, Aaron, trust me. So, so I said, well, if you think so, I mean, invite her, but treat her like one of the speakers, uh, you know, not like Aaron's wife. And she came and she presented and we do these surveys. Guess who got the, the top marks of all the speakers, Michelle. Yep. And then the next time Megan said, I'd like Megan or Michelle, I'd like your wife to be our master of ceremonies. Yep. And I said, really? You don't, I mean, she goes, Aaron, most MCs are all about themselves. Megan or not Megan, Michelle will be about the audience. Yep. She will do everything she can to help them get in the right frame of mind for learning that day to assimilate what all the different things they're learning to not get overly stressed. She said, Michelle is perfect for that. Well, long story short on that is now, and it's a little awkward because my business partner, Lee Morgan is there sometimes, but he's not speaking. And now pretty much everybody say, I want to thank Aaron and Michelle for putting on this event. I want to thank Aaron and Michelle for creating this business and for solving my problems. Michelle has, you know, shows up as the absolute co-host of the event. And I couldn't, I mean, we've been married 33 years. I, I admire her in so many ways but it's really heartening to me to have my wife, my best friend, my sweetheart, also be that kick-ass solving business owners problems, helping them have more success. And that's why she's so wildly successful in her coaching practice. Yeah. So anyway, there you go. There's the team, including uh, Michelle, who's a total badass. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. What's number yeah. one? Number one, it's a little bit of a surprise, I think, for some people. Uh, number, number one, the number one reason why you want to attend Magnify Your Wealth is, is your future. Mm. And it comes down to be that we all have big things planned, but we may not always be good at planning them. And as you always say, Aaron, uh, start with the end in mind and, and, and build up from there. You're... Big things aren't capable, aren't possible without big foundations or good foundations, right? Yeah, the, the idea of, of uh, begin with the end in mind is, or, or let's use this guy, I just used the example, he wanted his wife to retire, right? Yeah. He'd been working his tail off for many, many, many years doing what he knew how to do and he was successful at it. But he was able to basically double his business in just over a year because he learned some things that he just didn't know before, right? And if you want, you know, Amer as, 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 Ameri as any entrepreneur, but especially in America, we really, we, we believe we're going to be wealthy someday. We believe we're gonna have that yacht or that beach house or that, that 
fill in the blanks, whatever it is. The big fat bank account, we believe it. The only way to get there, folks, is to continue to learn better and better ways, learn new techniques, learn things you just hadn't heard about yet. My best friend is a Harvard MBA, and he went to one of my talks and he said, Aaron, did you know, they didn't teach us any of that at Harvard. Yeah. And we need it. Um, and I'm just telling you folks, the, um, if you want a different future, odds are you have to learn some new processes, learn, get a new recipe that will get you better results in a shorter amount of time. There is no magic wand. There's no pixie dust, but the more you know, the faster you will progress. And if you want a different future, if you want to take whatever you have now and magnify it, that's what we have developed for you at the Magnify Your Wealth Summit. And um, Scott, I appreciate you making that number one. Scott and I both wrote different top 10 lists. And then because I've been busy on calls, Scott put together his list. That's why I had to ask him to tell me what the next one was. <laughs> but I, I don't know that I would have um, thought to say your future. I want to add one thing, though, that isn't on your list. Yep. And that is when people come, when you buy a ticket to come, it's, it's buy one, get one. So you bring your business partner, bring your spouse, bring your CPA, bring your lawyer, bring the person that you want to get the information, to be in the meetings and to walk away with the knowledge and the peace of mind, walk away together rather than coming by yourself and then having to try to explain it when you get home. So, um, Anyway, that's, that's great. Thanks for that, Scott. So I, you know, um, I know we're at the end of the hour. Um, if people that are watching this want to come, we have a tiered pricing system that we start with early bird pricing and it just kind of notches up the closer we get. And it's not a um, hundred percent based on well, just arbitrary dates. It's based on as we get more and more people. So right now we're, we're almost, well, we're what, seven weeks away yep. and we're two thirds sold. And so um, the price is going up and it goes up, it, it goes up again on the 14th, which is about less than a week. But um, we, you talked to Megan and we, we, you guys decided if we want people, if anybody wants to attend, I mean, do you want to talk about this or do you want me to talk? Yeah, no, you go to, if you go to magnifierwealth.com and use the special promo code VIP. Yeah, uh, if you go to register, yep. you go, to, go to register, fill out the information, it'll say promo code or coupon code and put in VIP. And today, if you do it now, it'll save you $100. Mm -hmm. um, if you wait till the end of next week, it'll be $200 savings, but that code will only work for a, a few days. So go do it. If you're even, if you're curious, by the way, coronavirus, um, we have a lot of doctors that are clients and we don't want to make fun of this or downplay what's going on. But even the Surgeon General was on TV the other day and said, we've had 11 deaths from coronavirus this year. We've had 18,000 deaths from the typical flu. Um, Folks, we'll have ways for you to wash your hands and to sanitize your hands. And, you know, if you're sick, don't come. But I think there's a much greater risk of not coming than there is of getting the coronavirus. So, well, and, and that's come, the thing, too, is, is come. It's a, it's, they do a great job. It's a smaller, uh, smaller, I won't say smaller because 100, 150 people is not a small event, but it's what I'm saying. It's not like going to a big event like I went to this weekend. It was 1,200 people at, you know what I mean? Plus, yeah, it's but also an event over the next few days that will have thousands of people at them. And I'm going to go because our businesses depend on us to keep going. If we let every little fear thing that the media decides to promote stop us from functioning, and you guys look at this, the, you know, everybody's like, oh my gosh, the stock market, look what's happening. You can, folks, those people on Wall Street are making a mint by everybody freaking out and selling off their stock. Because you know, the, all those venture capital companies, investment banks are buying, as the stock goes down, they're buying up those discounted things. 
People in the know are not terrified by this. People who spend all day watching the news, they're the ones terrified. We're going to do everything in our power to help people be safe and sanitized and good. And you're going to leave there, not with the coronavirus, but you're going to leave with, <laughs> uh, with a whole new opportunity for a brighter future. The, the cure for a brighter future. Ooh, I there like you. that. There you go. So go to magnifyyourwealth.com. In, in, go ahead and register while you can at this price. Put in VIP. I think that keeps the price. I think that's two ninety nine or something. Yeah, it's, it's, ridiculous, it's ridiculously cheap. For people it's cheaper than what we'll spend on you and a friend just on the food. Yeah. <laughs> so come and check it out before the price gets up to $1,000, which it will over the next- that's The uh, normal price is 1000 bucks, but with this is a great- great price. This is an event that everybody should go to at some point. If for some re weird reason you sign up and you can't make it, I, I guarantee you, gonna, you go to the next one in November back in Yeah, you don't lose your value. You don't lose your price. Uh, but this is one event that you will not regret in attending. And I don't care if you're, you're newer on your path, or you've got experience in your path, or you're going through a pivot. This is one thing that is important to all of us is that we want, we work so hard for what we have, you wanna make sure and protect it. So once again, the website up there is magnifyyourwealth.com. It's exactly, it spells it exactly as it sounds. Promo code VIP for you guys. Um, there is a block of rooms reserved there as well, correct, Aaron? There is, and I, I honestly don't know what the price is, but they take good, really good care of us. Yeah. Um, so if you call, actually, if you, once you get registered, Wayne, as you're asking there, Wayne, call out to the Dana, they'll have a room block available there for you. Um, just call them, tell them you're with the Magnifier Wealth um, Summit, event. Yeah. Summit coming on the 29th, fly back out in the second. I mean, for those of you maybe have never been to San Diego, the hotel's maybe just a 10, 15 minute, it's not even 15 minute, 10 minute drive. To super, the super close to the airport, but not, not like where you're hearing airplanes, but just jump in a cab or an Uber, you'll be there in 10 minutes. Yeah, so. Exactly. And there's enough food. You don't have to rent a car, just take an Uber from the airport, come in, yeah. hang out do that take a later flight out on, uh, on the third day Yeah, you want to stay to the end you don't want to leave early because there is no cruddy content and we end at four on saturday it's a thursday friday saturday which gives you sunday to just relax so you could leave if you're tr flying in fly out on wednesday evening be there thursday friday saturday and um and then uh go home on Sunday. And yep. if you want to go around San Diego a little bit, it's fabulous there. It's beautiful there. Yeah, exactly. So any, yes, any I, other questions? Not right now, but that is Wayne. You're correct. Yeah. They do have a room block there. The Dana on mission Bay is a hotel. Amazing. Um, the staff at the hotel is amazing. One of the most on top of their game. I will tell you that. And I've stayed at a lot of hotels, a lot of nice places. This is one of the places I love going back to. Because there's just an energy about it. The, the palm trees, the sand, the wind, the boats, the water, the people. Uh, and then the, the, the people yeah. that are attending. The team, Aaron, and the whole staff and the experts. It's literally one of the must-attend events that I believe that for every entrepreneur to be successful. That's what we talk about in our mastermind. That's why we had so many of our mastermind students attending. If you go to yeah. the uh, Laughlin website, you will see testimony after testimony from a lot of our students and a lot of the people that have attended there. And absolutely real, you know, they'll tell you, they're not paid. They're there and they're like, oh my gosh, this is life changing. This is, it was evolution in my business from attending Magnify Your Wealth, everybody. So, any, Scott, uh, thank you so much for wanting to do this. This, this means a lot to me that you would want to share this with your audience. Um, and I'm so grateful to have you as my partner and affiliate and, and buddy. Uh, it means a lot to me that you would share this because um, you, you're such a great contributor, you know, when you come in and mentor people and, and um, I, I love being at your events. I, I love these opportunities. We have to work together. And uh, I love that you were humble enough to come as an attendee to this event uh, before you ever spoke and learned about it. And um, it, it just, it's a, it's a great relationship. I'm grateful for you. And same here, brother. Same here, man. Well, that's the thing, everybody. I, you guys know that if I mention something on here, it's either because of A, I believe in it, or it's something I use, or I know that there's value in this. And that's why we, uh, I reached out to Aaron and said, hey, I think it's, let's, let's have you on to talk about this event. 
You've got some time. It's April 30th to May 2nd. So you guys have over 30 days to book it, but that discount price is not going to be nearly as cheap as it if you don't take action on this stuff right no, now. Use, use the VIP code soon while it's still active yep. and come be with us and you're, you're going to love it. Trust me. Yeah. You will love it. You will love it. You will love it. And uh, you'll be better off for be attending there as well. So, but Aaron, thanks so much, man. Uh, this was fun. We'll have to do something, a, a different one again at a future date when we get to the next one in November closer to it. But this was a lot of fun doing this time around, huh? I guarantee you there are 10 more cool things. Oh, yeah. There's a lot. We had plenty to, to choose from. Exactly. Exactly there. <laughs> so, all um, right. Well, hey, everybody, that is going to wrap it up for this uh, episode of Note Night in America. If you listen to this on iTunes, take advantage of this. We're going to get this up as fast as possible as well. So it's well before April 30th. Uh, but once again, it's magnifyyourwealth.com. If you're watching the replay, take advantage of this and uh, get started. If you have any questions, you can always go to magnifyyourwealth.com and uh, check out the website there and, and, and contact Laughlin Associates or Megan as well. And her whole team will be there to help answer any questions and work with it and uh, go from there. So thanks so much, Aaron. You and everybody all have right, a great, thank great you. night, all right? Okay, good night. All right, and that's going up. Good stuff.